Hello all neat aspirants. Today I will be taking the first lesson of 11th biology that is the living world. As you all know the lesson is too big to be covered at the last moment. So the first thing to be done is go through the summary of the lesson. You should always add some points at the end of the summary which you feel are important or are not included in it. After reading the summary, just flip on the pages for the last moment and read the highlighted part which you have already done initially. And the last thing to do is the brain map what I call it as which is a short presentation of the whole lesson on a one simple page. So here it goes. We have the living world, the first lesson of class 11, the definition of tag taxonomy, the classification of units which form the basic that is species, genus, family, order, class, phylum and finally the kingdom. The later things are taxonomical aids which preserve all these living things either in dead dried form or in living form. So it includes herbarium, botanical garden, museum, zoological park, key or analytical key and many others. Others include only flora which is distribution of plants in a given area and manuals where species are kept in an area while monographs gives information of any one taxon. Then we have the living world. Why is it called as living? So there are few features which classifies things as living. So it is, it shows some defining, two, def, two non-defining and three defining features. So these include, the non-defining ones are growth, reproduction, while the others are defining. Ability to sense environment that is consciousness, metabolism and self-replication. Then we have R.H. Bittaker class 5 kingdom classification which includes Monera which is the only prokaryotic, Protesta, Fungi, Plantae, Animalia which are the 5 important kingdoms and the sub-classification as you all must have learnt already.